Eighth grade teacher in North Georgia has figured out a way to unlock history in his students' imagination. His project involves cleaning up a cemetery that predates the Civil War and has a special connection to their school. Local 3's Jemiah Beatty joins in the studio now with details from North Georgia. Jemiah? Greg Cindy, the history teacher at Gordon Lee Middle School, says the idea came to him after our coverage of a neglected cemetery in Lafayette. After seeing our segment, the teacher pushed his students to take action at a historic cemetery in their own neighborhood. Whether it's a cemetery in Lafayette or a cemetery here in Chickamauga, I think that connection kind of, I took, I took from it that we needed to really focus on our community as well. Every year before school ends, Jeff Guffey tasks the eighth graders at Gordon Lee Middle School with a community service project. This year, students clean up the graves at the Chickamauga Cemetery, polishing up the neglected headstones of veterans, family, and friends. I have family there. Some of them have family there. And I think it would just have been just a great idea for them to um, not only show their respect for the ones that have passed, but also for the community as well and help out the community mostly. The Chickamauga Cemetery predates the city of Chickamauga and is home to several Civil War veterans and the school's namesake, Gordon Lee. Guffey says there are about 1,200 graves here, the earliest of which dates back to 1847. A lot of times some of these people don't have family members locally. They may have lived here and their family may have moved off. And I was really concerned about really just keeping their, their grave as, as beautiful and as, as pristine as possible. Guffey's students say the project was an opportunity to get out of the classroom and reflect on those who came before them. There's a lot that you could even tell who's, who it was and what time period they were from because the graves date back to a long period of time ago. Guffey says the eighth graders cleaned about 150 headstones in three days, which he said left the students feeling accomplished. And seeing how worn down and not taken care of it was, I took great pride in cleaning the graves and restoring it back to full health. And the project reminds students to be active citizens in their community. These were humans. These were individuals who lived a full life. Um, and someone needs to to step up and, and actually take care of them even after they're passing, I believe. The cemetery has been in the care of the city since 1948, and also the eighth grade teacher says this project is one they hope to continue in the future. In studio, Jeremiah Beatty, Local 3 News. Thanks, Jeremiah. Now here's a